and mostly it was a lack of challenge because I'm a teacher so my kids were way ahead of where they needed to be when they got to school. For this Buffalo mother of six, the decision was an easy one. Educating her children at home offered a more challenging curriculum. Um, in the beginning, I had to make it more like the traditional class, and then eventually they, they took it on, and it's, it's more independent at this point, um, six years later. This family spends four hours a day doing schoolwork, and then off to after-school activities like dance, football, and science club. Fragrance says her children are growing in just about every area, both socially and academically. And this family isn't alone. New data from the U.S. Department of Education says more families are choosing to homeschool their children. The study tracked homeschooled families from 1999 to 2012. And in that time, the number of families nearly doubled to 1.8 million children receiving a homeschool education. And like Fragrance, who attended Michigan State, the study found that nearly 40% of the parents are college educated. And while this mom says the decision isn't the best for every family and her older children do sometimes miss the social aspects of a school setting for her family the pros outweigh the cons I want them to know that there are no limits you know I, I like the non-traditional sense of homeschooling for that you know that I don't have to worry about them ever feeling like there are, are limitations on what they can accomplish and the study found the reasons parents decided to homeschool their children varied. Several reasons included the desire for moral instruction and the fear of the school environment, including peer pressure and drugs. Sierra Johnson, 7 Eyewitness News.